Hi, I'm Pete with Moscow, and today we're going to talk about our Woodsman Pan. Uh, joining me is Jack, our mannequin, also our marketing manager. Jack is uh, 175 pounds, 6'2", size 32 waist. Uh, he's got on a 32 regular in the Woodsman. Normally he would go for a 32 tall, but uh, we were low on those, so this is what we had to do the video. Jack, could you spin around for us and show them the back of the pants? Jack also has knee armor on under here as well. So the Woodsman is a, an extremely comfortable, extremely tough, stretchy pant. Um, it's designed for enduro touring and trail riding. So by enduro touring, I mean uh, multi-day unsupported rides on primarily off-road terrain without a chase vehicle. The Woodsman really bridges the gap between dirt bike gear and adventure bike gear. Dirt bike gear is not really designed to su survive long-term travel. Adventure bike gear is designed mostly for riding in a seated position, not riding athletically, primarily pavement. That's why we felt we really needed this pant. You know, we needed something that was tough enough to survive long-term travel, but also comfortable enough to wear on the bike all day in a wide variety of different weather conditions, different riding styles, standing, sitting, all of the above. So when it comes to waterproofing, the Woodsman is a hybrid pant. There's a waterproof breathable membrane in the thigh and knee and also in the butt to protect you against wet branches, river crossings, wet seat. Um, however, we didn't make the pant all waterproof breathable membrane because those membranes aren't that comfortable uh, when it's not actually raining outside. So when there's really a downpour, you're going to want to pull on an overpant like the Deluge or the Rack. But for 90% of the riding conditions you're likely to encounter on a long-term travel trip, the Woodsman's going to be just perfect. One of the great things about uh, the Woodsman is because we didn't go with a waterproof breathable membrane everywhere, the nylon, Oxford nylon weave you see uh, that's the beige material on this Canyon uh, version of the pant is extremely breathable. So it allows for the free passage of air. There's no membrane to stop air from passing through. It also means we can use a much thinner material down here around the boot for tucking inside of the boot. Um, in addition to the natural venting of the nylon Oxford, we also have some great mechanical vents. There's a mechanical vent on the inside of the thigh and then also another large mechanical vent on the outside of the thigh. So when you're standing up on the bike, you'll feel a tremendous amount of air flowing through these pants. The Woodsman uh, is obviously a technical riding pant, so it works excellent on the bike, but it also works great off the bike. So for hardcore minimalists on say a week long camping trip, this can be the only pant you bring. It works around the campfire, works if you need to run into town, but also of course is your primary riding pant. A neat thing we did on the Woodsman is uh, we didn't cut them short like a lot of in-boot in -boot moto pants. So we cut them as a full length pant so uh, when you're wearing them without your motorcycle boots, you still feel like you have a normal pant on. You can throw on a pair of shoes, run an errand, whatever. So a question we get a lot about the Woodsman is why did we design this as an in-boot pant rather than an over-boot pant? I think most dirt bikers understand in-boot pants, but for a lot of people coming from the tour touring side of things may not understand why so many riders opt for these. Um, when you're riding off-road, there's so much abuse and abrasion happening down in this area between the boot and the bike, and also between the boot and the outside environment, like rocks, trees and branches, things like that. Inside, you're pinching the bike and you're pinching the material in an over the boot pant between the boot and the bike. And there's so much heat and so much abrasion created in that area that the only way to survive it would be to use incredibly uh, thick and heavy materials. So really, the boot is designed to rest against the bike. And so for hardcore off-road riding, most riders opt for in boot pants. A lot of people ask about with in-boot pants, uh, what about water? Won't water come down in between the pant and the boot? Um, and the answer is that with all in-boot pants, the Woodsman and any other dirt bike pant, uh, when it starts raining heavily, you're going to pull on uh, a waterproof overpant that's going to go over the pants and also over the boots. So uh, the Woodsman is an incredibly comfortable pant. Uh, we really designed it for enduro touring and trail riding, but what I personally found is that I'm using it in a very wide array of conditions. I use it on my 1290, I use it on my 500, I use it trail riding on my 300 two-stroke, I use it in the desert, I use it in the mountains. Actually turns out to have a very, very wide array of applications. Um, Jack, thanks for helping us out today. Everyone else, thanks for tuning in.